hey guys how are you all i hope you all are great and today we are going to talk about joseph andrew by henry fielding the full name of this work is the history of the adventures of joseph andrews and his friend mr abraham adams henry fielding called this work a comic epic in prose friends as uh, i got a lot of suggestions that I should speak in English more and as you can uh, see that I have already completed more than 200 videos on my channel for English literature and those all were basics okay and still I'm making these basics uh, basic videos on uh, some works but now I am focusing to make these videos a little bit longer for analysis for uh, description of uh, themes and the works so if you have not already watched my history of English literature videos, please do search English literature with Kaushik and you will find out my notes, my videos there. And I need a little help from your side. Whenever you watch my video, please thumbs up. It motivates a lot. And uh, second thing you can you can do, never forget to like the video. And uh, definitely it motivates a lot. So let's go ahead. Uh, so here are the notes today and uh, this book has four books. So today we are going to talk about first book and second book and a uh, small summary. Uh, you can say outline of the work and we will be talking about the characters too. Uh, friends, you are uh, students of English literature. So I request you to work on your English uh, communication as well who are uh, suggesting me to speak in Hindi I will try to speak slowly so that you can understand the work very well so let's go ahead again uh, here Joseph Andrew Henry Fielding Henry Fielding himself co called his, this work a comic epic in prose this work got published in 1742 why he called this work a comic epic in prose because this the nature of the work is comic and serious and you can talk you can call it drama as well so comic plus drama that's why he called it a comic epic in prose this got published in 1742 when we talk about a work we need to know the associated words and uh, the terms related to the work it helps us to enjoy that work. Novel came into existence because of this word, novella. And uh, please take your uh, pen and notebook so that you can make your own notes and it will help you in your exams. YouTube, watching all the time YouTube doesn't help in your study if you are not making your own notes. So take, take your pen, your notebook, every time whenever you are watching my videos or another videos but make your notes and it will help you in your exams novella this is asked in several exams what does novella means novella means a little new thing we this is uh, earliest novel one of the earliest novel and uh, as we uh, we can remember these words with the association with this work Samuel Richardson, Henry Fielding, and Daniel Defoe. These are uh, earliest novel writers. Kinds of novels, epistolary, picaresque novel, realistic novel. I'll be making a separate video on this. I have already made a video on this also. The basic definitions of the kinds of novels. So you can search English literature with Kaushik and you will find out my videos there. We, when we are talking about novel, we need to talk, we need to know about characters and plots, plot very well. If we talk about this work, Joseph and Geo, Henry Fielding, so what is important in this work? Important is and why one work of a particular writer becomes important. The reason behind it, it describes best the contemporary society, its prejudices, and uh, joys, frivolities, follies, and manners. So if it represents contemporary societies, 
the best the work becomes the best like canterbury tales we give a lot of value to that work now let's talk about this story this story is about joseph andrew as you can see here so joseph andrew is the protagonist the main character the whole story revolves around joseph andrew and his adventures joseph andrew was uh, his parents were not not known before but later it came came to know that he was son of mr wilson here are some uh, stories a story starts with uh, he goes to london and he meets there lady booby she tries to seduce him but he refuses why he refuses he is brother of pamela and pamela was his motivation to to remain chest he refuses and later he was kicked out uh, from her home he meets parson his name was adams so you can remember the name here the whole name the history of the adventure of joseph andrews and his friend mr abraham abraham adams so the this is the same person he meets here adams parson adams he is a great personality he guides joseph andrew very well after that there are lots of adventures we will be talking about his adventures later here is the short short summary you can say and about the characters later after these lots of adventures he meets fanny who is fanny he uh, she is his beloved he is in lo love with fanny his childhood friend he meets uh, again and her parents are unknown but later she uh, it comes to you know light later later people came to know that she was daughter of mr and mrs andrews pamela andrews and sorry these are characters i have written here okay let's go ahead here who is pamela andrew pamela andrew is sister of joseph andrew and as you know there was a novel which named pamela and that was written by samuel richardson here when he meets fanny and they uh, they sort of uh, getting married lady booby obstruct why she obstruct she talked about her unknown parents she told people that they are uh, she is daughter of unknown parents so so joseph andrews uh, should not or must not marry her but finally they got married because fanny's parents uh, you know were known now and joseph andrews parents are known too so here are some characters which are very important and as you know in every english literature exam these are asked so i have not written here some name of the characters but you can relate after listening to this story if you cannot relate please read it the story again you can uh, just watch the video again a modest lady so who was a modest lady a modest and chaste woman who is the chaste woman knowledgeable person who is knowledgeable person world is for pleasure who thinks this so as you can see knowledge is a uh, sorry world is for pleasure this thing is related to lady booby who is chaste pamela andrews and her brother andrews knowledgeable person adams 
मिस्टर विल्सन नाउ लेट्स टॉक अबाउट सम बुक फर्स्ट देर आर फोर बुक्स एज आई हैव ऑलरेडी टोल्ड यू दिस वर्क इज इन फोर बुक्स सो फर्स्ट बुक इन बुक फर्स्ट वट डू वी हैव दिस इज इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ कैरेक्टर सम कैरेक्टर्स आर इंट्रोड्यूस्ड हियर एंड इन दिस बुक जोसेफ विजिट्स लंडन एंड सीज लाइफ स्टाइल in this in this uh, book he used mock epic style joseph meeting with his uh, robbers and priest and here after meeting robbers and priest he he came to know about sharp contrast to the society growing relationship in this book uh, what is described growing relationship between booby and him then he travels he travels as barrister so it was uh, asked in uh, in a exam so the answer was he he traveled as barrister book second in book second his ability to explore the world it is shown and panoramic view of 18th century you will find in book second so what what do we find in book second his ability to explore the world and panoramic views of 18th century about england socio political state of england is shown in this work and court scene is very important in book second so court scene is if it is asked that where do we in in which book book first second or third or fourth we see court scene so the book second is the answer to reveal the politics hypocrisy and corruption three varieties of affections he talks about in this work issue of political kent covered pretense to courage ignorance masquerading as learning and in this book he shows respect for laws and joseph and fanny brought together in second book so we have completed first and second part of the book and basic under, uh, basic introduction of the work and summary and character so hopefully you know now characters basic summary of the work and what do we have in book first and book second in the next book, next video tomorrow i will be uploading that video you will come to know about book 3rd and 4th and analysis of the work so bye bye take care see you in next video and please this is my humble request don't forget to share the video and like and comment bye bye take care good luck for your exams